Yeah, hi, hello, welcome to 10 Minutes of Barbara Ian. What is it, Arnold? I'll tell you right now. Come on, listen to me. I got the biceps. I'm going to eat your little munchkins. Come on, Barbara Ian is a babe with one hit point. Look at her. She's so great. Let's do it. We're going to go down. We're going to go down in the dungeon. Come on, don't be a scared cat. Let's do it. I hate cats. Come on, I eat them with my biceps. I am Barbara Ian. <laughs> All right, guys. What's going on? This is Void Fox. Holy shit. And uh, this is Barbara Ian, a dungeon crawler where you only have one hit point. So I want to play 10 minutes of this, show it off for you guys, see what it's all about. Ah! And uh, see what's going on. For so, this is... Uh, by a developer called Owlbear, which, by the way, if you haven't seen them already, definitely check out their logo. It is incredible. Oh, I just hit <laughs> I just hit a trap. It got smoked. And we're getting right back into the action. This game gives you no break. It just jumps straight in. I'm cool with that. Oh! So, the objective of the game is to get as far as you can in the dungeon. Uh, you have one hit point, and so does every enemy you play against. Uh, fight against. So, yeah. There are different weapons you can find. We're gonna try to find one. They come in uh, in chests. This is breakneck en uh, engineering. I was about to say breakneck dungeoneering. I'm hearing the jingly jingles of a chest. I don't know where that is. It's somewhere here. You can run. You can dodge. There's a chest. We got wand of exploding, which uh, is my uh, least favorite weapon, for sure. Mainly because. Maybe because I'm not quite sure how you use it. <laughs> so, it plants it on the ground, and then after a certain amount of time, it explodes. All right. But it's not nearly as effective, I think, as the other weapon. It's very much a kiting weapon. There we go. I think I think we're good. But it, it's it's just I don't like it. Not a big fan. Other traps just popped up, so we gotta try to make it to the end of the dungeon. Uh, if there, it's here somewhere. Boom! That that noise was so loud it actually blew the menu or the the music from the game. Oh, here it is. So the gate will open, uh, which I believe requires you. Oh God! Which I believe requires you to. Um, there we go. To find all the treasure chests for it to open. So it looks like we got that. Oops. Here we go. If you sprint over those, you can, uh, you can get across without having to go around them. Whoa! Oh, I just killed myself. That's great. But we're back into the action. Let's go! Uh, every level is randomized, a.k.a. procedurally generated. So that's wicked because I love procedural generation. The game's really simple to control. Uh, they also can hit, get hit by environmental hazards. As you can see, you can get them to follow you into the blades of death, <laughs> which is pretty awesome. Um, so the AI isn't necessarily smart, but this game is really more of a, you know, like a dungeon crawler combined with a horde mode, I'd say. Uh, that's what it feels like. Kill all the goblins. Come on, do it. <laughs> all the HDs, come on. Uh, stupid clones. Okay, here. Oh, look out. We can t try to get them into the. Nope. We can try to get into the lava pit. We're doing okay. We got more coming here. I hear. Oh! Uh, I did notice that the. Oh, the attack is, is queued up to two times. If I click really fast twice, she'll chop twice, which. No, I don't want that. I don't like it. I don't want it. Oh, that was close. All right, so we found the chest. We don't. I don't think we have to pick up the weapon in order to proceed. Let's find out. Oh, you can zoom out. I forgot about that, which is kind of cool. You want to see more of the dungeon. Oh, it looks like we might have to pick up the weapon. So let's go. Uh, let's go get that right now and see if that's the case. Wand of exploding. And. Yes, so you have to pick up the weapon. You have to pick it up in order for it to uh, allow you to continue on to the dungeon. This game is a lot of fun. It is such a simple concept. 
and has a wick up pick up and play mechanic. You literally just jump in and go. And when you die, it it doesn't wait. It just pops you right back in. Ha, fell into the lava pit. Don't worry about going into the uh, menu. It's just going to take you right there. Oh, shit! Oh, God. These barrels can explode, which is nice. Look at the particle effect. So nice. So nice. Oh, I'm in trouble! I'm in trouble! Oh, yes. Let's, let's see what this is all about. Oh, no! I did not see the explosion! Loot chest to proceed. I want to show you a different weapon before we go forward. Hopefully, there we go. Oh, one of exploding. That's okay. You can restart. I think. There's a button for it. A secret button. I don't know what it is, but I know it exists. It's R! Haha! -ha! Never mind. It put me... What? It respawned me? With the wand. Why you do this? Oh, God, no! Oh god. Oh god. Barbara Ian! Oh no! <laughs> Fall into the pit, you bastards. Alright, hopefully we get something better here. Sword of Fatness. Alright, I think that's the standard sword, but you know, I'm okay with that. Uh, where was the exit again? Over here. Down we go! Get down! Well, we got a big enemy type. I just died. I am the worst. They are just wrecking my face. Oh, I hear the... Uh, here it is. Wand of Exploding! What is going on? So the first time I played this game, I actually got the axe and the hammer. Which, those are my two favorite weapons by far. They're a lot of fun. I want to be able to show them to you. Oh man, this Wand of Exploding is so satisfying when you do get the hit. But in terms of, uh... It's a little weird, though. There we go. Okay, we're not gonna mess around anymore. We're gonna make it. Yeah, this is a lot of fun, guys. I'm, uh, I'm enjoying this. I love the, uh... Oh, God! The fact that it is as advertised! It is a breakneck engineering! So you can roll and dip and dodge and all that. Oh my god! You did Oh shit! Did I get him? I think so. Oh shit! <laughs> that guy with his Gigantor club. Oh, I like how the floor smashes when you come in. Alright, here we go. Here we go. Look at that. Three at once. Ah, I am Barbara Ian! Come on, do it! Stupid targets! I throw my hammer at you! Oh my god, oh my god. Here we go. I died again. I'm I'm really bad at this. Oh, okay, here we go. Here we go, guys. A new weapon. We got ourselves a crossbow. This is a serious weapon. This is a serious weapon. That pierces, by the way, so you can get like multiple goblins all in one go. I do like that. Ooh. Of course, uh, you gotta be ranged. Oh! Oh! Oh, wow, that was a good one. Boom! Here, another big guy. Sounds like I heard another big guy. You can destroy the traps if you want, which is good! Absolutely is good. Come on, you little goblins! You damn clones! Come on! Okay, we're good. We're good. We're good. I can't see anything! Oh yeah, zoom out. Let's see. There's a door. Yeah, if you knock out the lights, it can get pretty dark. Oh, I hear a chest. Uh. So this is where uh, you can't just wait them out. You gotta dip dodge out! Oh, dang it! As you can see, I am very- Oh my god, I died right out the gate. Barbara Ian! Yo, that song is stuck in my head. It is insanely awesome. 
If you time it right, you can kill multiple with one swing. I am not that good at this game. But! But! Uh, I absolutely love this game. It's just, it's just wacky, man. And there we go, guys. Axe of Axing. One of my favorite weapons. This game, it, or this uh, weapon is like, smells barbarian all over it. Watch. Whee! It's so awesome. Uh. <laughs> Damn it. Yes, I got it back. Each swing does two swings. Whoa! It's wicked because it's all physics based too, right? Oh, it's so sat so satisfying. <laughs> oh. Wow, there's a lot going on in here. I can't. I don't know what's happening. Yes, let's go down. Get down. Yeah, I hear another uh, dungeon. And that's the thing, in order for this to work... Oh, I smoked those guys. In order for this to work, you have to choose the weapon that's in the box. Ah, uh, so I'm stuck with Wand of Exploding. Unfortunately, that is the way it is. Come on. Oh, they're gonna get smoked from this thing. Okay, we gotta sort of place that there. Boom, skis! There's a chest there. We're gonna get chased by those stupid goblin clones. Come on, blow up! Boom! Yes! What do we have here? Axe of axing. Damn, I really wanted to show you the uh, the hammer. Because, my golly gee, is it great. I just died. Why am I the worst at this game? Here, maybe this will be the hammer. Oh, God! Now it's all, all it's giving me is the axe. This game really is about timing, too. How you swing. Because uh, there's a back... Like, a, a secondary slower swing... With the axe, so you can time it just right. You can hit multiple goblins. It is so satisfying, this axe. Let me tell you right that right now. So it looks like we've hit our 10-minute mark. This has been 10 minutes of Barbara Ian, a fantastic dungeon runner where you and your enemies only have one hit point. Everything is procedurally generated. Uh, for first impressions, I'm really liking this. I am really liking this game. It is a great pick up and play game. The developers are wicked rad too. They're very communicative, both on the Steam forums and on uh, Twitter. So please feel free to you know ask some questions if you have any. Uh, they promise the game is going to get better. In fact, they say if you don't like it now, don't worry, it's going to get better. Come on, just buy it, do it. Uh, so it's a lot of fun, guys. Definitely enjoying this so far. Uh, look out for any future videos I do of this. Because I do plan on doing a more in-depth impressions video of this sometime in the future. Sort of fatness. Let's see if we get a hammer here. If not, we'll move on. Hammer of the Gods! I got it! Okay, let me show this to you really quick, ladies and gentlemen. Hammer of the Gods is so fun. Oh! Because you just smish smash and it stays floating for a little bit so you can smash people in the face with it while it's floating. Like, check it out. You can direct it. Woohoo! It is great. Oh, it is so great. I'm just going to run like crazy. Uh, the exit was where again? I don't even remember. Right here. Well, hell, we're going over 10 minutes, guys. I apologize. But that just means more content for you to... Oh, no! Oh, God. Oh, God. There you go. See, on the way back, it'll hit too, which is awesome. Yes. I love this weapon. This weapon is so crazy satisfying. Let me tell you that right now. Uh, where is the way out right here? Go! Uh, right now, I've only seen two types of enemies, but that could be because I haven't really gotten too far down into the dungeon. I've seen these little goblin dudes and uh, the big goblin guy. Oh, wow. You just got burnt. Here we go! Oh, yeah. The hammer's so good. <sighs> oh, I just fell into a portal. No! Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. If you enjoy my content, please feel free to subscribe, like the video, all that fun stuff. I love you guys. It's been great. This has been Void Fox. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. I am Barbara. Yeah.